Dolphin fans, what's going on? I'm Mitchell Renz from Chat Sports, and I have some news around quarterback Josh Rosen. Before I take a deep dive into it, I do want to give a special shout out to Manscaped because without them, this video wouldn't be possible. Go to manscaped.com and use code DOLPHINS at checkout to get 20% off and free shipping on the best male grooming products. Let's dive into this news, I guess, if you will. Here's a tweet from Adam Schefter with Miami's rookie quarterback Tua Healthy. The Dolphins have fielded trade inquiries in recent days for the former first-round pick Josh Rosen per league sources. In an upcoming weekend of moves, Rosen could be on the move again. So guess what we do here at Chat Sports? We talk about the latest around the Miami Dolphins. If you haven't already, make sure you click that sub button. So the report, when it came out, I was like, really interesting. So this has been something that we've seen pop up on the news and rumors around the Miami Dolphins, but... The only issue here with this rumor is, even if Tua does appear fully healthy, and I do believe that he is, the real question is, will they actually move on from Josh Rosen, who just last year, this team went out and traded for? Now, you're never going to get that actual value that I think a lot of people might still believe Josh Rosen has, but ultimately, it is something that we are going to continue to talk about until either Josh Rosen has moved on from or if Miami decides to keep him or, heck, maybe even cut him. So if you are a diehard Dolphin fan, what I want you to do right now, it's 100% free, and it takes about two seconds. All you got to do to stay up, on, stay up on the latest Dolphins news and rumors is click that subscribe button. If you are already subscribed to the Fastest Growing Dolphins channel on YouTube, Take the link that you see below, youtube.com slash Dolphins News, and send it to one, you know what, no, three big Dolphin fans, we would definitely appreciate that. With all this Rosen news, though, from Schefter, it made me think, because I was like, wait a minute, I just did a video yesterday, and here's a quote from Brian Flores on the starting quarterback situation. We're not saying somebody is one, two, or three. It's still a competition. Obviously, Fitz has played well. They've all played well in spurts. And they've all made mistakes. We've got a few days here. I think we like where we're, all three of them are. And we'll continue to leave that as a competition moving forward. So yesterday, head coach Brian Flores says that he likes where Fitz is. He likes where Tua is. And he likes where Josh Rosen is. So Fitz, he's obviously a free agent in 2021. Tua is clearly the future. But the only issue that I have with this is, are you really 100% confident in going with Tua as your quarterback too right now? Because... There are still some, well, injury concerns there. And Ryan Fitzpatrick has always been balls to the wall. Shout out to Manscaped. He does get some injuries too. So if you don't want to throw Tua into the fire right away, maybe it's not that smart to potentially trade Josh Rosen. So I'm going to ask you all this question, and I'm going to make it the pinned comment on today's video. Should the Miami Dolphins trade quarterback Josh Rosen? If you're saying, yes, Mitch, they absolutely should. I want you to type your Y for yes. If you're like, no way, man, don't do it, type your N for no. Scroll on down while you're getting with that ad break and let me know Y for yes or N for no. Special shout out to today's sponsor, Manscaped. Go ahead and use that promo code DOLPHINS to save 20% off and get free shipping on the Lawnmower 3.0. I use this product every single week. It is rechargeable. You can use it in the shower. There is a light right at the very end of it so you can get in those hard-to-reach places and see what you're doing. Also, go support our sponsors because without Manscaped, I'm just being real with you, this video, all the Dolphins videos that we've been making, they wouldn't be possible. So go support our sponsors, manscaped.com. Use promo code DOLPHINS, 20% off, free shipping. Just trying to hook you all up. I mean, it's also hot as balls in Miami, so make sure you're taking care of them because they're going to thank you if you do. Let's take a look now at his career at it has not been pretty, right? I mean, when you're drafted number 10 overall, these are not the stats that you're hoping to put up. You want to look at wins and losses? It's not great. 3-13 and 13 from a career standpoint. Completion percentage, that looks like the grades I was pulling in in high school. Yards, also not looking too good. Touchdown to interception ratio. Bottom line is this. It has not been a very solid start for Josh Rosen. And with all the trade rumors that continue to pop up, you need to remember this. He was traded before. The Miami Dolphins at one point gave up a second round pick, number 62 overall back in 2020. The reason why I'm showing you this is because if you're Brian Flores, if you're the Miami Dolphins, what are you trying to get back in return for a player that 
Sure, you ended up getting a 2020 fifth round pick, but for me, I looked at it and I really think right now for Rosen's value, you guys can get mad at me, yell at me, IG, Twitter, I don't care. My name's down below, Mitchell Ren365. I believe it's a sixth round pick. So knowing that, think about it, play GM for a second. Would you trade Josh Rosen for a sixth round pick in 2021? If you're like, yes, absolutely, I want you to type six for yes or type zero for no. Let's look at now some potential destinations, if you will. I understand the New England Patriots are inside the division, but I mean, come on. We're already seeing Jared Stidham has back issues. Are they 100% confident in Cam Newton? Yeah, this might be tricky because it's an interdivision trade, but the New England Patriots, they could definitely use Josh Rosen. The Pittsburgh Steelers might be the number one team on this list because behind Ben Roethlisberger, it's like really, really ugly. The Los Angeles Rams pop up to me because besides Jared Goff, they also have no one maybe to get the most out of Rosen. You send them back over to California. Maybe has some friends over there at UCLA and get things together. The Minnesota Vikings, I mean, Sean Mannion, come on. And then Matthew Stafford did get, injury last, did get injured last year. So for me, those are my top five trade destinations for Josh Rosen. Perhaps they don't trade him. Perhaps this is all just a bunch of smoke and mirrors because anytime a team is thinking about moving on from a player, there's a, uh, in quotes there, a leak trade interest. So perhaps with the 53-man roster cut deadline coming up on Saturday, 4 p.m. Eastern time, by the way, go subscribe to ChatSports, youtube.com slash ChatSportsTV, where Tom Downey and I, Harrison Graham, we're going to be breaking down a lot of these cuts when they happen. So make sure you go ahead and do that. But Josh Rosen is at least interesting because as soon as I saw these trades, I was like, hmm, could they potentially cut him? Personally, I wouldn't do it. So what I wanted to be able to show you all is his cap or his contract details. 2019 already happened. But in 2020, 2021, those are obviously the years that you need to look at. Right now, he's going to make $2.2 million on this team. If you cut him, it's going to cost you $4.95. Now, believe it or not, I didn't do very well in my SATs in the math section or really in general. <laughs> but that's not what you're looking for. So why not just hang on to them, keep them, because if you have a worst-case scenario where fits and then Tua goes down, you do still have a little bit of an option there in Josh Rosen. So what would you do here? We talked about trades. We talked about cutting them. Or would you just flat-out keep them? What should the Miami Dolphins do with Josh Rosen? So type K for keep, type T for trade, or what I want you to do is type C for cut. If you made it this far in the video, Please click that sub button and give us a like.